Hello, students, and welcome to class. Today, we're looking at this article that says that these 18 vegan Costco products will have you signing up for a membership ASAP. Well, let's see if that's true. All right, let's go through the list of these 18 things. You tell me in the comments below, would this make you want to sign up and get a membership? First of all, they have this, these cinnamon rolls here, Annie's cinnamon rolls with icing. Well, I can tell you that cinnamon rolls are one of the, my most favorite foods in the world, especially if they're gooey and really sweet and with a lot of cinnamon. And I don't know what these taste like, but this makes me want to devour the entire package. Although right now I'm only eating whole foods, but you know, as a dessert once in a while, that would be something that would interest me. Now we have here something called pretzilla, soft pretzel bread. Oh, that sounds good too. It's not a whole food, but if they have it, that would be something that I would like to have. What about you guys? Here we have Beyond Burger, and these are something that I also like. I find they taste just the same as any other burger. And we have here something else. This is, what is this? Let's see. This is a Lattice Apple Pie. Well, apple pie looks good to me. So if they have that at Costco, that would be something that would interest me as well. What else have we got here? Crispy chicken patties. So this is not real chicken. This is plant-based, it's vegan, it's dairy-free, and it has 10 grams of protein per patty. So that looks like something I could also try. What do you got? What about you guys? What do you think? Does it look good? You can put some vegan cheese on there if you want to. And then we have here something else. This is dairy-free almond drink. That sounds good. Yeah, Bailey's, okay. Um, what else do we have here? Chow cheese. Have you guys ever tried this kind of cheese? It's actually very good. Many people like this brand. It is vegan and it is made with tofu. So that's another thing that you can get at Costco. Now I don't like Costco in many ways because they have a huge meat section and a huge dairy section and a huge egg section. And at a certain time of the year, they have lobsters in a tank and it's so, so sad. But you know, it's good to support vegan products. Okay, here's a mac and cheese. Now mac and cheese is something that I used to eat all the time before I was vegan. I mean, it's a complete junk food. There's nothing really good in there, but this one is vegan. So dairy and lactose free, Four grams of protein for each uh, each meal. You guys tell me, have you ever tried this brand before? If you have any experience with these brands, let me know in the comments below so we can uh, know whether we should suggest them or not. And here's something else. Roasted garlic, cashew, and almond dip. All right, well, I love garlic. I love cashews. I love almonds. So yeah, this looks like it would be something I would really enjoy as well. Then we have here some jackfruit. Have you guys ever tried jackfruit? Jackfruit, here it is filled with oven baked jackfruit. It's some sort of like bun thing. Oh, this looks good, ready in five minutes. Okay, so we have a sort of a fast food type of thing here. Jackfruit is delicious. It sort of has the same consistency as meat. If you guys have ever tried this, let us know in the comments. It says there's no preservatives here and it says vegan. So we check the label and it's vegan. That's good. What does it say here? These soft, fluffy bao buns are filled with saucy barbecue jackfruit and vegetables. It can be found in the refrigerator section. Okay, so that's where you can find those. All right, next up we have deep, dark chocolate, rich and creamy, bittersweet chocolate, cado avocado, frozen dessert, dairy-free. Okay, so this is like a kind of like a, a vegan ice cream. It's dairy-free, soy-free, vegan, and gluten-free. Made with avocado, which is a type of uh, vegetable that has some good fat on it. So that sounds like something I would like. Have you tried it? Oh, I'm sure it's delicious. I'm quite sure. I mean, avocados are so good. Oh, here's the mac and cheese. Another, I guess, a different brand, vegan mac and cheese, 100% plant-based, seven grams of protein per serving, a jalapeno and cheddar, mm, but vegan. So nobody needed to steal any milk from any cows in order to make this cheese. So that sounds like another good one. Another thing we have here, organic ravioli, grilled vegetables. What? Ready in three minutes. Huh, product of Italy. That's good, made with turmeric. Turmeric is a spice that is uh, something that you should have on a regular basis. 
What else do we have here? Another one. Parmella Creamery, plant-based sharp cheddar, aged 60 days. Okay, so that seems like it would be good. I haven't tried it yet. Have you guys tried this one yet? It says, it says it's made with cashew milk. That's kind of interesting. All right, what else have we got here? Next one, JoJo's Guilt-Free Chocolate. Okay, hmm, interesting. Oh, so it's like a protein bar, gluten-free? Looks like some sort of a protein bar. Yeah, here, 14 bars in this. Okay, neat. That's good when you've got to have some protein and some calories when you're out on the go. And impossible, made from plants. This is a, a kind of meat that you can make and use uh, for spaghetti sauces and chilies and things like that. So burger made from plants. All right, so this is a package of that. They have that at Costco as well. And what's this one? Better Bites, chocolate chip do bites. Chocolate, what does this say? Chocolate, okay, cookie dough, oh wow. Top eight allergen free, oh neat. All right, what does this say down here below? Better Bites, these chocolate coated cookie dough bites are gluten free, vegan and so tasty. The individually wrapped bites keep us from eating the whole box in one go. Yeah, I, I hear you. I've done that. I've eaten like entire boxes of things in my life where, where something tastes so, so good. It's so addictive. Okay, but now I'm a lot more disciplined than I used to be. Anyway, this is bitchin' sauce, chipotle. Um, so it's a sort of an almond dip. Okay, cool. I'm sure it's good. Anything with almonds in it seems to be good. Have you guys tried this yet? Is it spicy? Does it taste good? Look, they have the sign here, vegan, so that's great. All right, number 18, we have, uh, oh, that is the last one. Okay, bitch and sauces, so that is the last one. All right, so you guys let me know. Which ones of these have you tried? Which ones of these would you like to try? Have you tried any of them and that they're actually not that good? If so, let us know, be honest. You know, it saves people the time um, from buying something. But of course, everyone has different taste buds. So, um, you know, you could always try it anyway. But if there's a specific one that you think is like really, really good, let us know. I want to thank you all for being here today. Um, if you like this kind of video, like and subscribe and uh, press the notification bell. Um, that way you will get a notification every time a new video is up and we can share information together. Thank you so much for being here and I will see you all in the next video. Bye for now.